Hi, are you currently experiencing pain in your tailbone, pain in your rear, or pain down below in your pelvis? If so, listen up, I would love to share a simple release that you can do right now at home. Hi there, my name is Justine Calderwood. I'm a pelvic physical therapist, and I wanna show you something that you can do with just a small inflatable ball to help relieve your pain. So we're gonna use just a small inflatable ball and we can put it into this area. So we can go really close to the tailbone or we can come over here to the side into the buttocks or you can even just bring it down below. So that's what we're gonna cover next. Um, so we're gonna be releasing the muscles but also the connective tissue called fascia which is why this makes it a mild fascia release. To do this release, you're gonna need a small inflatable ball. If this one is between four to six inches in diameter, so a little playground ball, or if you are a current patient of ours or have been in the past here at the Healing Spot, then you likely have one of these. I recommend pick a nice soft surface like a bed or a couch, and we're gonna actually lie down on our back. So go ahead and do that. And then what you're gonna do is just find, by kind of rolling to one side, you're just gonna reach down and you're gonna find where is your pain. So again, it might be down low, right at the tailbone. It might be into the buttock or a little bit higher, okay? And, and all of that's fine. If your pain is down below, more into the genital area in the bottom of the pelvic area, I'm gonna show you an alternative way to do this. But what you're gonna do is take that ball, find your area of pain, and you can either be directly on it or close to it. You're gonna place the ball into the area and you're gonna just roll your body weight back onto the ball. Now from here, you have the option to adjust your weight. So you can keep the um, hips or the knees rolled away from the ball, that's gonna take pressure off, or you can roll the knees toward the ball and that's gonna put a little bit more pressure on there. You also have the option of keeping the knees bent or straightening them out. From here, all we're gonna do is allow the body to kind of drape over the ball and start to relax and release. Now I'm not gonna go through this full release with you right now, but I recommend holding for a minimum of three minutes, allow your body to soften and let go. If um, you can hold a little bit longer, five minutes or longer is actually even better, okay? It leads to more longer lasting um, pain relief. One thing I would like to say is you can use the small ball. If that seems like it's too firm, then I would even just roll up a little hand towel and you can use that instead. We just wanna place some really gentle pressure into the area. I do, however, advise don't go with a really firm ball because it can, um, it can be a little bit too much, especially if you're just starting out, okay? So stay away from tennis ball or racquetball um, at this point. An alternative way of doing this would be sitting in a nice soft chair, okay? So you'd still use your ball or that small towel. I'm gonna to show you back here. Basically what we can do is we're gonna be releasing into the pelvic floor muscles. Those muscles attach onto the tailbone and onto the side there of the sacrum. So I recommend just finding the sits bone. Um, you're gonna be able to feel that underneath you and placing the ball basically between the sits bone and the, either the rectum or the very edge of that tailbone. You can just place it right underneath you and then again, let your body kind of drape over um, into that ball. All right, and one final thing I wanna tell you is you can actually use a wall. I like this option, especially if you're really having a lot of pain because you are in more control of the pressure. So basically, just like when you were trying it lying on your back, you could just place this behind you and lean up against the wall, okay? Again, just adjust where your body is and maintain that gentle pressure for three to five minutes.